Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, and commenting to uh, the video. Let's get into this. Thank you God for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message from you. Scorpio, we have a new moon upon us. You can uh, make a donation, contribute to the new moon money jar. If you're trying to usher in more money, of course, abundance, joy, peace, all things new and good, you can contribute any dollar amount to the new moon money jar. The link is below. Uh, a collective prayer and ritual will be done uh, to uh, manifest corporately. All right. So you can contribute if you're feeling moved to do so. Let's jump into your reading. Let's see what's coming for you in the near future. Courthouse. Okay. And bad health. All right, so this could be bad news in terms of some paperwork, um, some documentation, maybe being sued or being summoned. Um, it, it seems pesky right now. It seems petty also. Um, you could also be turning down uh, or bowing out of this because you're sick or you're under the weather or you're at a place of needing to deal with your own personal health or maybe a loved one's health. So um, you're not able to make engagements here. Um, with the courthouse, this could be like a literal courthouse. You're needing to answer for something you are being um, served or summoned or um, you need to answer some type of petition. Um, it, it doesn't feel like good news. You you really don't want to deal with it. You feel like it is a waste of time. It's, it's um, again, petty or pesky. And some of you are going to go put something to rest at a courthouse. Like you're going to get do something in documentation or you're going to get something documented. Maybe somebody's stalking or pettiness or you get something in order or you make order out of this you feel like something is chaotic right now and you want that to end somebody could be divorcing you because they found out about another love relationship female or someone has taken a step back somebody feels like the relationship is just friends with benefits it's it's frivolous it's carefree it's petty it's not serious it's not real all right so let's see what's going on in terms of soulmate energy let things come and go let things come and go stay calm don't let anything uh, disturb your peace carry on so it's like some of you are trying to stay in a place of peace calm and serenity you're just not letting maybe somebody's pettiness or peskiness or bothersome behavior um you're not going to let it make fluctuations in your emotional health like you're not going to get all upset and riled up about this you're going to accept things or a person for what they are or how they act and you're just going to carry on or you should carry on um you also aren't going to let something disturb you or disrupt you or someone is doing this in, in regards to you Follow your heart's desire and manifest the heck out of your life. So it's like you're really going to be focusing on you, on getting things done. You could be going to a courthouse, needing to file paperwork, needing to make changes, needing to do that. That could be the peskiness also. Um, it's just like you're just really focused on your heart's desire. And it really doesn't involve another person who is uh, causing conflict, drama. Let's see what's going on for career and finance. Yeah, leap of faith. Uh, feed your fear or your faith. Okay, so leap of faith here. You need to take that. You need to just jump out there on faith. Beginner's luck. Um, a calculated risk. Letting something new develop here in your life. So yes, and it's also maybe what you prayed for. Answer prayers. Gratitude. Yes, give thanks for all you have. So you have a lot. Um, if you don't have a lot, do be expecting a lot. Contribute to the new moon money jar if you're feeling moved to do so. Um, gratitude. What you appreciate will appreciate. If you got a bummy car, still go wash it, clean it. Make sure that it's vacuumed out. It smells good. You take care of it like it's a Rolls Royce and see um, 
that appreciate, see that thing, see you have a new car within a certain amount of time. You know, um, I can tell you that really works. What you appreciate, appreciates, okay? What you are not grateful over and grateful for, you get stuck with. Um, because you need to be grateful over the small things so that your God can bless you with the larger things, okay? So always be in a place of gratitude and gratefulness because um, there's so much more to come. Also, it's building character here. This is what I have for you, Scorpio. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting. Um, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Contribute to the new, the new Moon Money Jar. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you.